welcome to this adventure, Wassel Science. The leaves there are changing. Here we go, talking about the harvest time. Join us as we look at the science of why leaves change color, what goes into harvest time, and all that cool stuff. Let's go. If you feel like in the fall, sometimes you pack on a few more pounds, it's not just because you're eating more food around the holidays. Researchers actually say the lack of vitamin D from the sunlight that our bodies aren't absorbing as much can also lead to putting on a little extra weight. One of the biggest misconceptions that I see over and over in the science lab is why we have different seasons, or at least why we go from summer to fall to winter, back to spring, so on and so forth. It actually doesn't have anything to do with our distance from the sun. In fact, we're actually closer to the sun during the colder months than we are during the warmer months. So why is it so much colder versus why is it so much warmer at different parts of the year? Well, it all has to do with our axis. So the way that we're tilting, if we're tilted towards the sun, we're gonna be a lot warmer, like in the spring and summertime. Whereas we tilt away from the sun, it's gonna be colder. Oftentimes here in America, we call this season fall, whereas in Britain, they often call it autumn. Whether you call this season autumn or you call it fall, it means the same as far as what's happening here on planet Earth. The days are getting shorter, there's more of a crisp in the air, and we know that winter is on its way. I love pumpkin pie, but did you know that pumpkin spice actually doesn't have anything to do with pumpkins? It's just the spice that goes into that pie. Amazing and pretty interesting too. Check this out. See all those red colors, beautiful colors behind me? Did you know that the color a tree turns during the fall months is direct relation to how much sugar is in the leaves? This is why maple trees turn those deep red colors because they're storing more sugar. This is also why evergreen trees, because of that thick coating, that thick waxy layer on their needles, which are their leaves, they don't change. They stay green all year round. That's amazing that chlorophyll in a pine tree doesn't break down, whereas in our friends, these broadleaf trees, it does, which allows us to see these awesome colors. So cool.
Our feathered friends spend most of the fall months in migration. The Arctic Tern can travel 44,000 miles within this time span. Just amazing. Again, migration, migration, migration is what birds are thinking when the fall months come. Fall color tours are amazing. Just to take a drive and to see the amazing colors that these leaves just pop with during this time of the year. Well, it's also big business if you're in an area like New England, right? Those states, that can bring in about $3 billion annually during the fall tour, during the color tour season.